Hello Internet, it's Big Dave here, and I am cheap. How cheap? Well, I'm so cheap that I'm doing everything I can to get my grubby little mitts on the presents in the great gift pile during Steam's holiday sale. You can earn achievements in some of the games that are on sale, as well as do little things around the Steam community. It's very similar to, uh, to the summer camp sale. Uh, you can do these little achievements or these little tasks around the community in order to earn uh, an opportunity to get a present from the Great Gift Pile or a lump of coal. If you get a lump of coal, you can turn seven into a present. There are amazing deals. In short, I'm going to have a boner from now until January 2nd when this sale ends. So. I have an achievement that I'm going to try, and I'll try to do one of these over the next couple of days for you guys, uh, but uh, this is a fairly easy looking achievement. It's for Orcs Must Die, uh, a game that I have not played for you guys yet, but most of you have played because this game has been well reviewed since it was released, and it's been on sale a couple of times. So if you haven't played Orcs Must Die, shame on you. It is on sale for, oh, about another 30 minutes as I'm recording this. Uh, so uh, go ahead and check out uh, the Steam sale and Orcs Must Die. Uh, this sale is amazing. Keep your eyes on it. Do the little things every day that you can do uh, to get essentially a free gift. Uh, for instance, all you had to do was look at the gift pile in order to get your first gift. Back in the uh, Steam Summer Camp sale, you had to do things like post a screenshot to your profile, post a video to your profile, join the Steam Summer Camp group. Easy stuff like that. I would envision them doing more of that stuff, so keep your eyes open. And in the end, you can trade your lumps of coal in for prizes, or you can trade them in in the uh, sort of raffle off of every Steam game. You can win every game on Steam. Uh, you guys already know this. I'm a little late to the party. I didn't want to make some grand celebratory video about it because so many people have, but you guys know I am sexually aroused by these kinds of deals, and... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get to this and see if we can't get something really, really cool for free. Uh, I'm not an Orcs Must Die Pro. As you can see, I've done the hallway once, and it's not quite been good enough to top the folks on my friends list who've played. Uh, I did unlock the Wall Arrow Trap. Uh, this is the Deck the Halls achievement, which requires you to complete the hallway using only the Wall Trap. Uh, so we're going to try that. We're going to we're going to cross our fingers, and we're going to hope that we can actually complete that achievement. If not, it's going to be kind of embarrassing. Wouldn't you agree? It's all up to me now. We can go Rest through that well, cinematic. Man. First things first. And I guess Let's all we really need is the two things in question. Uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and set up a couple of traps right in these way, super obvious places. And let's just see how that goes. So here we go. Uh, for those of you who don't know about Orcs Must Die, as you can see I'm no expert, I've barely played it. Uh, but it is a, uh, it's a sort of a tower defense type game, but it's, it's much more active. And that's, that's been the new... Uh, that's been the new sort of MO for uh, tower defense games. They're going very interactive. Um, and uh, this game is no different. In fact, it's it's been a trailblazer in uh, sort of redefining what tower defense games can be. Uh, uh, I hear a lot of people say about Orcs Must Die that uh, I don't like tower defense games, but I like Orcs Must Die. So, you know, that's saying something. Uh, you know, like, I could, for instance, say, I'm not attracted to men, but I think Justin Timberlake is quite a looker. That's the way that a lot of people feel about Orcs Must Die. And might as well spend the money while we got it. Uh, and again, we're trying to get through this level just using our uh, Pew Pew and our Arrow Trap. So we're going to see what we can accomplish. Things are going pretty well. I actually did a, a practice run of this, and I did okay on it. So uh, that was actually my high score. <laughs> Uh, when I did the practice run, so we'll see how this goes. Fingers are tightly crossed here uh, that I will not embarrass myself. I do certainly want to get a prize, so I'm heavily, heavily, heavily relying on my limited game playing skill to uh, earn myself something free. Come on, orcs. Come to your death. 
come to your death. So everything seems to be going to plan right now. I mean, I've got this sort of uh, alley of death here that they're all uh, running through, and really, I, I don't think I need to bolster it in any way. Uh, yeah. Let's just keep doing what we're doing because it's working. Oh, that music is getting me pumped. Oh, that was a headshot. Oh yeah, let's keep killing orcs. Let's finish off this wave. Only three waves on this initial level. This is really the, the get a feel for the game level. Um, a lot of the achievements that you'll notice during this sale will be really simple achievements. Some of them are hard, or seem hard, but uh, and they were during the summer camp sale as well. Uh, but there's always some low-hanging fruit. And uh, it's kind of interesting to, uh, to set the sales up in this way. Uh, the idea being that you can buy a game and then immediately install it and play it and get an achievement that gives you something else free. How awesome is that? I think that's pretty awesome. Um, you, you know, this is about the second or third time I am playing this game, and I have to say, everybody who said positive things about this game, I'm with you 100%. Uh, this game's putting a smile on my face. I'm really, really enjoying this. There we go, and we got Deck the Halls. Turn your attention to the lower right-hand corner of your screen, and you will see Deck the Halls achieved. Let's see if I beat my top score. I don't know. Maybe I did. But there you have it. That's it. I'm going to get something free for that, or I'm going to get a lump of coal. I don't really know which. We'll, uh, we'll do a, a cinematic fade or uh, some sort of a transition here, and I'll take you guys out to my Steam uh, page, and we'll see what I got. Cool? All right. So here we are on my objectives page. The objectives for December 19th, I have now completed it, two of those. You can see the first one was just look at your inventory, and you got a gift for that. Uh, and that gift was a 50% uh, off token for uh, a Valve game. I don't know if you guys may have gotten something different. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, but actually, you'll see what I got because we have to go over to the Steam inventory to see what my prize was. It's either going to be a lump of coal, maybe a free game, or maybe some other kind of discount token or something like that. So let's check it out. Oh my god, I won Dota 2. Oh, hardware survey, what? Why is that a gift? Wait, did someone send it to me? I don't know. Anyway, I got a lump of coal. Wah, wah, wah. But uh, I can trade in seven lumps of coal for a gift, so um, I'm excited about that, I guess. Uh, there's my 50% off uh, any Valve game. I don't really know if there are any Valve games left that I actually want to buy, so uh, you guys might uh, get that. It is tradable, right? Tradable, yes it is. Also notice Alpha Protocol, Arcadia, got a couple of games on deck here to give away, so uh, keep your peepers open, keep them glued to the Twitter. You know I like to give stuff away on the Twitter because you guys don't pay much attention to it. Uh, so yeah. Lump of coal. I don't want this thing to run too long, so we'll go ahead and uh, close things up, folks. Uh, this has been Big Dave, and it is a fantastic holiday season. I hope you're enjoying it with your family or by yourself. I'll try to do one or two of these over the next couple of days. I can't guarantee I'll do one every day because it is the holiday season, and one does things during the holiday, like spend time with your family. And that doesn't always allow you to make videos. So, uh, guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate everybody here on the channel continuing the support. I see a very bright 2012 for Big Dave is Cheap. Also, uh, just brought my Rift content back over to Tales of Talara, my Rift channel, as I departed from TGN Rift. So, uh, it's a very exciting time for me in my little corner of the internet. I kind of feel revitalized as I sort of take back my personal space and bring my content back to my own channels. All right, guys, I have been Big Dave, and until next time, take it easy.